Hello students, let us learn about an underwater world so massive that it stretches longer than the entire coastline of Australia. A world glowing with colours, teeming with life and built by small creatures that are smaller than your fingernails. This is Great Barrier Reef that I am talking about. It is Earth's largest living structure. Located off the coastline of Queensland near Australia, this coral reef extends over 2,300 kilometers with nearly 3,000 reefs and 900 islands. It is the only living thing visible from the space and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Not only this, this structure is also a biodiversity hotspot. But how did it form? It all starts with the tiny coral polyps. These small animals, built limestone skeletons, live in partnership with the microscopic algae called zooxanthellae. The algae gives coral reefs food and color, and over thousands of years, layer upon layer, coral builds up, creating a giant reef what we see today. And changing sea level allowed the corals to spread over the continental shelf, forming the modern Great Barrier Reef system. As I told you, it is a biodiversity hotspot. Over 1,500 species of fishes, 400 types of corals, dozens of sharks, sea turtles, dolphins, dugongs, vibrant reef plants are present over here. So it can rightly be called as the rainforest of the ocean. The reef is not only beautiful, it is also vital as it protects coastlines from the storms, supports local fisheries, generates billions through tourism. But the problem here is this wonder is under threat. The raising sea temperatures causes coral bleaching. Coral lose their algae, turn into white and they'll die. The reason here is these are the sensitive organisms that can be grown in only certain conditions. Climate change brings stronger cyclones, ocean acidification, and it also leads to slowing the coral growth. Pollution from the agriculture and explosion of crown of thorn star fishes also damaging the reef systems. Yet, the fight isn't over because the scientists are res restoring the coral reefs and governments are enforcing marine protection zones. The global climate action aims to save this natural masterpiece. So the Great Barrier Reef system is gonna revive again. And this system is a reminder of how fragile our planet's wonders are and how urgently they need our protection. For more content on coral reefs, please do subscribe our channel and go through the long video that was discussed on coral reef system. Thank you.